Good morning. Just wanted to give you an update what we got going on today. Uh, it's been raining now for, gosh, a week plus. And uh, I'm, I'm sure we got at least a couple inches in the last day. A couple inches the day before the uh, spring and stuff down here is just absolutely flowing. I couldn't even get near uh, the bank and stuff out there because it was just uh, flowing. Hey, there's my little ah, turk, turk. turkey turkey. Uh, but anyway, so Cole, uh, Kelly's youngest, came up and we are going to do a couple things. Um, this is the the son that um, ended up uh, gifting me his uh, his BMW. But this, this other one here, this little truck back here. Uh, we're gonna work on his truck a little bit. Uh, get some things going for him um, that he didn't have to pay for to get rolling and uh, um, fix some stuff on there. And then he is going to help with us uh, getting some of the building going. So I did get my friend, our friend Randy. Um, he is willing, or he got a hold of a um, a person here in the area that has a ton of the uh, foam and uh, so we'll have plenty of foam from what I understand to be able to finish up all of our insulation and stuff like that so I just got to get with him to figure out where the stuff is sitting maybe Cole can help me go bring a bunch of that stuff back home but uh, one of the things we're going to do today is finish up the uh, little contraption for um, you know the uh, the little foam cutter the wire cutter uh, deal and uh, I'm going to cut the foam up that we have here before I bring another block of foam back to the house and go from there. But hey, check this out. Uh, remember I did the, um, uh, the submersible pump install down below? That was the first day that we've had any sun. Where is the sun? Can you see it? There it is. Uh, had any sun at all. And it's about uh, 8.30, 9 o'clock this morning. But I wanted to give you a report on that. So these panels run our battery system and stuff in here that run everything on, on the homestead. The panels that I have down there, the two panels, are the ones that run specifically this pump. So let's see how that, let's see how much flow we're getting. Hold on to this so I don't lose it. Okay. Good flow, 440 feet away. Pretty good. There's our pump right there. So, I might actually uh, go in and, and reshow the submersible pump with how this is actually working on a, on a sunny day. So I'm, I'm very happy with that. That's more flow than I've had before. That's a 24 volt pump instead of just um, a 12 volt pump. And it's submersible, so I don't have to deal with priming issues and things like that. So that thing is hauling. I'm very, very excited. Let's go back and look at that one more time. Pretty sure based on the flow that we have. Just notice the uh, the depth of the tank. Um, you can see that we were pretty much about a foot from the bottom, which is, uh, I'm guessing probably 200 gallons. We're just conserving here these last couple of days. Didn't take showers for a couple of days just to wait till the water stuff uh, topped off. So we had, you know, drinking water, flushing water and that kind of stuff. And um, I, uh, I estimate by the end of the day today that we should probably have the entire cistern topped off. So that's pretty exciting. Okay, we'll talk to you guys later. Bye.